Hello guys, today we will be I will be showing you my bottles. So uh, first off, we have a 1930s cork top um, chemical or medicine bottle. Very nice cork top there, as you can see. Very nice bottle all around. It's got out the triangle on the bottom. Real nice solid bottle to have in your collection. Next bottle that I will be showing you today in my bottle collection is a milk of magnesia bottle uh, from Glenbrook, Connecticut. As you can see, it says milk of magnesia, the Chaz H. Phillips Company, chemical company, Glenbrook, Connecticut, down at the bottom. On the back, on the bottom, it says made in the USA found this bottle on my property nice solid solid find next bottle I found this bottle in Houston Texas in a bottle dump there it's a three-in-one oil three-in-one oil bottle from the early 1900s it's got a it's got the blob top and everything it's a real nice bottle on the side there it says three in one and then yeah three in one oil company three in one real nice bottles got that blob top on there right there my finger is on the bottom it says C I don't know what that stands for maybe that's an initial I don't know C Next bottle I will be showing you is a little bottle, a cool little bottle. It's got the screw top, four cider. Looks new, but it's a really good bottle. Cleaned up real nice from the 50s. I put oil in it. It's a cool bottle. It's a container holder. Screw top, yep, worth about 25 cents to nothing. Uh, this is a bear aspirin bottle that I found on my property. On the cap it says, keep out of children's reach. And then on the side, bear aspirin. Bear aspirin. So it's a cool bottle all the way around. Worth about two dollars. Yeah, found it on my property. Next bottle that I'll show you. Cork top ink, ink bottle. Found it on my property. Worth about two to three dollars. Real nice condition. We got a Vapo Cresoline Poison bottle that I found in the Houston dump. Solid, solid bottle there. Um, aqua Blue, Pontal, Cork Top. Really nice bottle. No cracks, no chips, no dents, no hairline marks. No nothing. Nothing wrong with that bottle there. Next bottle is a very skinny bottle. It's a uh, oil bottle. Held oil or some type of liquid. Um, but yeah, it's a screw top. Long found it on my property it's worth about two dollars one to two dollars at the most nice bottle there oh and by the way this is the 2015 episode of my bottle collection 2015 bottle collection okay next bottle I will show you is a forty dollar bottle by the name of J.R. Rieger J.R. Rieger bottle. It's worth about 40 bucks. Um, Kansas City, Missouri. 
flop top stress ring. It's got the slug plate with the writing on it. Regular bottle bottom. Yep, and the seam ends right there, so we know that's uh early nineteen hundreds. <coughs> Sorry. Okay. Here's a little medicine bottle. It's got a cork top. Cork top uh square medicine bottle. One, two, three, four sides. Find it on my property. It's about two ounces. Amber glass, nice find. Um next bottle has a blob top. It's a J.R. Watkins bottle in cursive. And um it's got the blob top. It's worth about four or five dollars. It's got a lot of dirt and stuff in it, real dirty stuff in there. Yeah, it's a nice find, J.R. Rieger. I mean, not J.R. Rieger. J.R. Watkins. Nice bottle. Next bottle is... It's a mystery. It's a mystery, people. Hala. Two ounce cathedral medicine. Not aqua, so we know this is about mid fifties. Cathedral, two ounces, two dollars. Pretty cool bottle. I like them. Uh, we got a uh, Certo here. Certo, um, jellies and jams, mixed jellies and jams. It says right here. For half bottle, pour to here. It's a real nice bottle. At first, I thought it was a soda. It's a Certo. Real nice bottle. I like the shape and the design. Reminds me of soda bottles. Oh, right here we have another one of those two ounce, two dollars Cathedral Medicine bottles. Pretty cool bottle. Found it on my property. That Certo bottle I found on my property as well. Uh, yeah. Next bottle is a olive oil bottle. Pretty long. I'll show you how slight it is. It's got the blob top. Goes in. It's long, long, long. And it just folds out on the bottom. Pretty nice. I should see if I can. Stand it up up here. See if it shows the whole thing here. There it is. Pretty nice bottle. Found it on my property. Worth about four or five dollars, the most. But that blob top is pretty cool. Probably a Civil War era bottle. So yeah, that's a pretty old, fairly old bottle. Um, next bottle is a common, common is dirt, but still a cool bottle. Cork top, regular medicine bottle. You can see it has the, it's got the cork top there, it's clear. Nice bottle. Found on my property with about 50 cents. But I wouldn't sell it. It's not worth enough to sell. Here's a bottle stopper. I love bottle stoppers. They're really cool. Just a clear um, green. Found it on my property as well. Okay, next bottle is a cork top ink bottle. Pretty cool. It's got the cork top. It's worth about three dollars, three four dollars. Find it on my property again. I got a big bottle dump on my property. It's got a lot of bottles on there. Uh, yeah, pretty solid find. Yeah. Nice solid bottle.
Uh, we got a nice little uh, cork top, cork top medicine bottle there. As you can see, it's got the cork top on it and everything. It's pretty cool. It's worth about two dollars. Found it on my property as well. Uh, we got a paint set amber bottle from the mid fifties. Pretty cool bottle. Um, put that right there. Next bottle, we got a tiny, tiny little guy. Tiny little medicine. Yep. And we're just going to do a couple more. And stay tuned for part two. Got a tiny another little one. And yeah, that'll pretty much wrap up part one of my uh, miscellaneous shelf mis miscellaneous uh, bottle shelf thanks for watching have a great day